morning guys i hope you guys are well so i'm actually going to the Cotswolds tonight just for one night a little mini staycation um I'm gonna sit on the floor. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know that I absolutely love the Cotswold and yeah, everything has been a little bit hectic with the house. Can I move this down a little bit? Everything has been a little bit hectic with the house and Ollie just wanted to get away for the night, so he booked us a little stay in the Cotswold and I thought that I wish you guys what i'll be taking with me and i also got um some new pieces from new look so i thought that i would pop in here a little mini new look haul as well but yeah i'm kind of like sitting here i need to pack my bag <laughs> this is my new duffel bag um from a lovely brand called katie loxton um i've actually brought a few of my friends some of um like their candles and diffusers before for their birthdays but i never realized they actually did like bags yeah they kindly sent me um the full weekend overnight bag so i thought that it's the perfect time for me to use it so yeah i'm gonna show you guys what i'm packing i woke up feeling really puffy this morning so i am gonna put on some eye masks um i'm just gonna use the bare minerals skin longevity one yeah it's been a little while since i've actually popped on an eye mask to be honest i've been lacking on my mask game which is terrible so I usually do like a face mask at least twice a week but because everything's been so busy I just haven't had the time but much needed eye mask this morning I'm also drinking leftovers of my lem sip uh, I totally forgot about it and I went downstairs and I came back up and it's cold but it's fine okie dokie right so um, should I do the packing first or should I do the haul first? Hmm. Maybe I should do the haul first to show you guys some new bits. So first up, we have a trench coat. So beautiful. I love the silhouette. I like that the sleeves um, are like slightly, slightly puffy, not really puffy, but a little bit of a shape going on there um i went for a size 10 which i mean i'm a size 8 to 10 depending on the brand um but usually i will go for like a size 10 or size 12 um in coats and jackets this is what i picked up so nice i cannot wait to style this up with a pair of like knee-high boots i think that would look pretty really cool another autumn winter staple a black faux leather blazer i have one before but like it was a little bit too like slim line i don't know how like too fitted there we go that's probably a better word it was too fitted which i didn't love and i really wanted something a little bit more boxy so i got this one from new look um again oh i actually got this one in a size 12 just to make it like really oversized which I absolutely love. Um, and again, like when this arrived, it didn't have a weird faux leather smell as some like items do. Oh my God, these are slipping. I just thought that this was such a lovely piece. And I think I might be taking this to the Cotswolds to wear tonight for dinner actually. So I'm just actually gonna pop this to the side. Another item that's perfect for autumn and winter, a sweater vest. I picked up this one because I just love the gray and I love zebra print. This is so nice and soft and cozy. Also picked up a gray vest top. You can never have too much of like um, ribbed vest tops with like the race and neck. I live in these. I'm actually wearing one from Brandy Melville like underneath right now usually i wear these kind of tops like every day super easy to throw on and they go with everything so yeah i picked up a gray one but i know that they have like a bunch of other colors so i will leave a link to them down below as well 
I also got two dresses from New Look. New Look does really good dresses. Uh, my white one that I wore all the time a few weeks ago was from New Look and it sold out super quick. And because I wore it all the time, I wanted to get a black version. So that is what I got. Literally so comfortable, goes with everything. And it's so flattering, absolutely love. And then the second one, which I think I'm gonna wear for dinner tonight, is this floral, like satin material. And it has like a little cutout as well under like the boob area, which is so nice. And I absolutely love this print. It just kind of screams holiday to me. And I wish I was wearing this on a beach drinking a cocktail, um, but I'll settle for the swabs tonight. <laughs> it's super lovely and it has like a tie back so you can cinch in um, as well and it's such a beautiful dress I absolutely love it I think this would actually look really nice with the blazer over the top I don't know it might be a little bit too much but I think because I don't want to take my leather jacket because if I'm taking my leather blazer already so <laughs> okay it's time to take these off Oh, my eyes feel so much better. Okay, so let's start packing for tonight. Okay, so I, I'm actually gonna pack the black dress that I got from New Look, just because, you know, you always need some options. I don't know if while we're having dinner tonight, it's gonna be like outside or inside. So I'm gonna pack the dress. I'm also gonna pack the other dress. The floral one, this one, because I just really want to wear this. It's so pretty. I love it. Oh, I also have a new cord piece, which I also want to wear. Um, so I might either wear that tomorrow daytime when we're coming back. This is really cute. This is from French Connection. It's like a really nice lightweight material. Like again, would be so nice to wear on holiday. But yeah, it's in such a beautiful kind of print and color. So it comes with like the shirt. It also comes with matching trousers. I think I'm gonna pack those as well. Um, also wanna pack a big ass t-shirt. I've been sleeping in big t-shirts. And this is one of my favorite ones at the moment. It's from Frame. I actually think it's like a men's t-shirt, but yeah, so comfortable. So my PJs are sorted. I'm really good at packing, but usually when it comes to pajamas, I always forget to pack some sort of pajamas. So now I just chuck in like a big t-shirt that I can just wear as my pajamas. Got a bra, let's pop that in there hairbrush um oh my glasses yeah let's pop that in there a claw clip when i wash my face gonna pack the leather blazer i just think it looks so nice over the satin floral dress um usb cable kind of pre-packed my toiletries and my makeup last night so my makeup is in here i always bring a ton of like lip options i always bring a red lipstick because you never know you might feel a little fancy and you want to pop on some red lipstick and then my toiletries i try not to bring as much toiletries as possible especially if it's like a one night trip if it's a holiday i'll probably bring maybe like a bag or two of like skincare and stuff um and everything you need but usually i like to pack super lightly on a one night stay got my eye mask in here got my perfume this is such a lovely classic scent here as well actually from Ole Henriksen, which is my favorite, favorite face mask. So if I have time tonight, I'll probably do that after. My toothpaste, so cute. David's Kiehl's Serum. My Chanel body lotion in a tube, because I'm chic as fuck. Of course, 
my Sunday Riley slip cleanser, which is amazing. Um, and then I've just got to pack my tooth brush before I go. Can you not show your bum hole? Can you not do that? Thank you. Yeah, I love you too. Unfortunately, Dexter is not coming. He's gonna stay at my mum's, um, which is fine. He loves staying with my mum because he knows that he gets like a lot of treats and love. Yes, you see mummy Kwan later. Yeah. Yeah, I am getting a massage for so excited. I haven't had a massage in so long and just sleeping like on the mattress on the floor has been <laughs> painful. Um, and from painting all the doors and stuff last week as well, like my whole arm is in a lot of pain. So, um, but yeah, I think that's kind of pretty much done for the packing.